Uh oh. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute, gentlemen. What's that? What's that I see? You know what we're doing? <laughs> we're grabbing him? Man, you gotta love the dog. We're snapping him! <laughs> Play Fortnite. Jesus! We had a dilemma last night. Mrs. Assassin and I. True story. We take a high executive, all black suburban Uber to one of the hottest German techno nightclubs in the area, I think it's Watergate. We get dropped off right in front of the club. Boom, six, seven people. I thought, I thought, I thought it was, you know, I thought it, they rolled out the red carpet or something, right? Six, seven people come attack Mrs. Assassin and the doctor. Why? They wanted to sell illegal drugs. Right then and there, I knew we were in the wrong area. We stand in line for five minutes, five minutes too long. We get to the front, there he is, six foot four, six foot nothing. The bouncer, cocky thinks he's a hot shot. I get up right in his face. I say, do you have music inside? He says, yeah. I say, how many floors deep? He says, two. So I walked away. It wasn't a five-story deep German techno nightclub. They just had me a mic. I don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this thing. But today is when the real fun starts because we've invited 40 of the world's best streamers, team them up with 40 of the world's best players to compete in a charity showdown. Do you think that your experience as a Counter-Strike Pro for Cloud9 has given you the edge over someone like Dr. Disrespect? Because you're used to playing in big spaces like this, aren't you? Yeah, I mean, that experience doesn't matter. I just, you know, I know, I know I'm better than Doc, so I got that over but him. But you I have to break this to you. You're on the same team. You're on the same team. How does that feel to be blasted by your own teammate, Doc? It's not, it's, it's, t trust me, it's not a good feeling, okay? <laughs> One of the games, I'm actually walking away from the station. I'm going to go get something to eat. I'm going to come back uh, when there's a top 10 situation. I'm going to clean up the rest of the survivors. I mean, and if Ninja's one of them, mm. Oof. done. <laughs> oh, he's coming for you, Ninja. Yeah. Doc must be boiling hot. Yeah, the AC in here is just jammed. Actually, we got, a custom, we got a fan right here. Look at this. Hope that fan is blowing straight on the marble bag. Trust me, it is. Trust me. It's game time. You didn't bring your uh, dirty keyboard? I didn't, but I did. And don't get them mistaken, okay? Right, we did. That way I get to drag my mouse all over my crotch the entire day. We're playing with an elite team. We're not here to hide. We're not here to get one or two kills and win the game, right? We're here to get 20 kills. Match start, here we go, baby. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go, let's get it warmed up. Raul! Woo! Okay, this is what I'm thinking. Uh, we go all the way to Severny, then we slow play it through the shooting range, make sure we're all looted up, and then we maybe hesitate and go to Roscock just because, wow, I don't really want to run into anybody. <laughs> I'm just joking. All right? Doc trying to do his own little bit of a push out. Shroud's coming as well. McCoy oh, we with the flank. He's inside, huh? He's inside red. Inside low. Just one more. He's one, he's one shot, go. one more, one shot, one shot. He's jumping out. Good. There you go, baby. I'll get out. Shroud's coming to help him, and he'll be there in time. Wow. McCoy a... claiming two of them, but they will keep Bravo's hopes alive. But Wacky Jackie's going to get knocked too. The rest of the rest of Bravo now pushing in hard. One ball out the back, I'm pretty sure. Back of this right flank. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. Don't worry. I need to wake up anyways. <laughs> I need to wake up anyways. But do they still know that Moon Eye is staying in the tree, is staying in that small little corner? He's hiding, looking for the oh. right moment. Shroud will do the execution inside the bathroom. He's checking the corners. He's worried. And now he looks, comes in close oh. to Shroud. He ducks under the bullets of Moon Die. I have to sacrifice me. This guy's moving across from right to left. Hit him once. Yeah, yeah. Uh, they move to the uh, to the west. 280. Shroud is trying to keep this together, but I think they don't have the utility to keep Doc oh, alive. The head. Uh, Shroud's running back. McCoy will have to go with him and just see if they can push further around to the north. Shroud looking, trying to finish him <laughs> off. Baiting with a jump. There's a shot. That one will connect oh. for Shroud. Say goodbye to McCoy. Shroud now the last soul survivor for oh, Bravo. No! And well, goodbye Bravo.
eliminated in 15th position. You know what? That was a good run for them. They found themselves in a lot of team fights. Shroud has kind of shown here that he can swing with these pro players. They went toe-to-toe -to -toe with one of the most skilled squads and did come out on top, albeit with a little bit of help, but uh, that was a good showing for the first game. I like the flow of that game, though. Yeah, that was really nice. Pretty good. It was just a kind of a weird area. Yeah. It was like two, three teams just floated right into that little yeah. trifecta of the mountain, the ruins, those houses. You know, I get excited when the Doc looks like he's ready to actually murder somebody <laughs> that won't be himself. Like that whole snap, like you hope is not going to be the Doc himself. Because he, he did go down pretty early. I think he's ready to murder most Lights. of the time. I think that he's... Uh, you know, a, a very high energy individual, clearly, and uh, at this stage, that was just a warm up, as they say, and of uh, course. getting getting used to it, of getting course. used to the environment, making sure your chair is the right height. Which game number is this, and how's it going? This is game number two out of four. First one, uh, I mean, we're playing aggressive. Let's we're playing it simple. There's, let's not beat around the bush. We're landing in a hot zone. We don't care who comes with us. We're gunning out of it. We're listening for gunshots, we're rotating to them, and we're getting involved in every single fight. That's what's happening. Balak there, holding for the AK Shroud, going for the med. Golf is pushing. They're going for it. Shroud is down on the yeah, hillside. Oh, he no. needs to open up, and they're going to finish. Shroud, oh. they actually end him. The manners is there. Biggest stage for Doc since 1994, I believe. Looking to take home another championship. He's uh, battling the odds. <laughs> only, only two left standing on the team. Has, has he still got it after all these years? I don't know. I mean, the back to back. Yeah, I see them. Just keep running. Yep. There we go. Just one more up the hill. Keep going, keep going. Yep. See if you can make it all the way. Yeah. Good choice here from Doc and Balak to grab this house. Oh, this could be good. This could be good. This looks okay. One, two, three. Drop, 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 drop around the side. Oh. He gets tagged up as well as the grenade. There the damage is. is enough to get the knock. He's still got another one. How is Balak just an armory? Nades after nades after nades. They're going to push this Doc actually out of position. Funky M's looking no the right support. way. No he's going to see Balak on the jump out. Look around the corner. Oh, no. Balak, he's going to get knocked. It's up to the Doc. Funky M's pushing forward. He wants to finish. He'll claim Here it comes quickly. Support. Doc, where are you? He's right on side of the head. He's low, Doc. Jump on it, bro. I'm feeling it. Good job, Sometimes you gotta get right in their face. Good call, Shroud. I'm dancing around him, looking good. You know what I mean? Dude. Nice try. Still third place. Pretty good salvage. Play zone, and there's the dock. I'm not a happy. A little bit upset, I think. So close, yet no cigar. But it's still a great performance. <sighs> Sound muted. I'm not happy about it. Welcome to the Champions Club. But I still look good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can you get Shroud to jump so we could see his vertical leap? Welcome. People want to see your vertical leap. My vertical leap. Yeah. I don't. I can't jump. <laughs> I've never heard another human being say that they I don't cannot know how to jump. jump. Okay. That's fine. No, well, we just won't I talk just, about it. I got. I got short legs. You can't be. You can't be embarrassing me like that. All right. We can't all be six eight. Well, six eight doesn't mean you. You. Can, I'm just like a, a crazy rare athlete, right? Okay. That can jump and yeah. who's tall. Because a lot of people, whenever I go to the park to play ball you know they, they 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 size me up real quick and they go oh this is another tall white guy i got this guy it's a mismatch and that's where i remind them and dominate them and then i walk away on top yeah i've never i've never played uh, baseball before so baseball yeah. yeah you're talking about playing baseball right yeah got, I've, got I've, yeah i don't know <clears throat> Sound resumed. Sound resumed. You know you can turn that off, right? <sighs> Shroud, I, I feel like you have an answer for everything. And it's, I'm just it, it, it just I, pisses I, it, me off how couple, cocky you are. It's a couple clicks, man. I'm just saying. Okay. Oh, I forgot. You don't use TeamSpeak. 
I don't. You, you use that, um, that, what's that, what's that bad plan called? Uh, you want to say it for me? Or? Sure, it's called $550,000 in sponsorships. <laughs> This guy's one shot up up top left. Right in front of uh, Top left window right in front of me. Uh, one's on the wall. Uh, left me, I guess. Far left. Okay. Maybe I'll knock him I see him. I see him. Hit his helmet. Just this good teamwork coming out from Team Bravo. Flash goes up. I don't know if it caught the other player. It certainly didn't. And oh my god, this could be a disaster. He has that to make a hit, he's only got two bullets, remember. He's surely going to just spray through the door, and he is. That's the smart play from McCoy. Take no chances, take no prisoners, takes the kill. And it's, well, it's Ghost Gaming's player, but it's Team Bravo working their way through Pachinki. Yeah, we kind of have to, like, leave these guys. Yeah. Knock, knock one. Only one left. He's right here on me. Find the building, so he might be reviving. You can run around the right side, Bob. There you go, baby! Oh, you didn't kill him. It's our last yeah. game, Shrap. Oh. If we see one win, we can still win it all. Oh, yeah? Yeah. If we win the next game, we win the entire thing because of our high level placements. It comes down to the final game, and I love it! Shroud, how pumped are you? Uh. <laughs> Hot. I'm real hot and, and it pumped with sweat and hotness. Deep in a dark alleyway, the doctor finds himself in a world of destruction faced off in the last game of the biggest battlegrounds tournament ever alongside McCoy and Balak and Shroud. Two guys up there. Oh boy. That's really bad. Yeah. Oh my Six goodness! Shot. Six shot. I think the second guy's up there too. Do we have an eight? Yeah. Please. Shroud, please. Make it please hard. Do Go it. on, Shroud. Let's see what you can the do. The rocket's goes going up. up it comes down. down. It oh, six. What? How is he alive? Shroud, if you win this game for us, I'll sign you my new eSport team, okay? <laughs> okay. There you go. You do you, Shroud. Did you smoke the two seat on drive off? I'm doing mid. I'm dead. I'm dead. That's it. Yeah, nice try. I'm lucky. Nice try. Nice try, Shroud. Firm handshakes, everyone. We'll see you on Monday. Thanks for tuning in on this extreme special edition live broadcast from Berlin, Germany. Man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, have a good night.